For thine is the kingdom and the power and glory forever. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, one God. Amen. I really love praying to God, Dad. I feel like I never want to stop talking to Him. Praying is the time when we are in direct connection with God, Lavinia. It is the time where we can forget about the world and focus on what is important. God, you know what? I will tell you a story today about a saint who loved God more than anything in life. He didn't want to stop praying to him. Who is this, Dad? He is Saint Bishoy the Beloved. Oh, I love Saint Bishoy, Dad. I'll never forget when we visited his monastery. To be there where he lived was so much fun. Yes, my dear. It really is a beautiful place. Okay, let's start. Saint Bishoy was born in the year 320 AD. He was the youngest of six brothers. My dear sons, come and eat, and then it will be time for bed. Oh, Mom, you look so tired. After our dad died, you were doing everything for us. You should really take a rest. Oh, don't worry about me. I love you and your brothers very much, and all I want is for you all to be happy. Thank God we have you, Mom. We really love you. What is this? Who are you? I am the angel of God. God wants one of your sons to be his servant. They are all for God. Choose any one of them. Bishoy will be a good servant for God. But Bishoy is weak. Choose one of my stronger sons instead. Do not worry. The strength of God is made perfect in weakness. At the age of 20, Bishoy left everything and went to the desert of Shehet, becoming a monk there. Thank you, dear Lord, for accepting me to be a monk. Now I will live all my life worshipping you. I really love to pray to God, and I don't want to sleep. I want something to keep me awake. Yes, I know what I'll do. I will tie my hair to this rope so that any time I shall fall asleep, the rope will pull my hair and wake me up. This way I can continue my prayers without stopping. But that must have been so hard, Dad. How can someone not sleep and keep praying all night? Saint Bishoy did this because he loved God. He didn't want to sleep and stop talking to him. You mean he felt no pain from doing this? Oh, absolutely not, my dear. In truth, he was very happy. One day while Bishoy was working in front of his cell, something strange happened. Who is this? I see a weary traveller. I will go quickly to this old man and ask him to come and take a rest and eat something. Come, please, and have a rest here. Thanks so much but I don't want to bother you. No, I will be really happy to serve you. The Bible says, do not forget to entertain strangers. Thank you so much. Come, sit here and I will wash your feet. You must have traveled a long way. Put your feet in this bowl and I will wash them. What are these injuries in your feet? Oh, are these wounds on your feet from nails? Is this you, my Lord? Behold, this is my Saviour, Jesus Christ. Blessed are you, my beloved Bishoy. I will always be with you and will bless this place. Blessed Father Bishoy, we know that Jesus loves you very much. Please pray to Jesus and ask him to appear to us as well. I will pray for you, my dear son. My dear sons, Today, Jesus will appear to us all atop this mountain. Let's go quickly to see him. What's happening, my son? Why are you all running? Jesus will appear to us at the top of the mountain. Can you please carry me so I can see him as well? I am sorry, but if I carried you, we will not reach in time and I will miss seeing our Lord. I am sorry, but I must go. Can you carry me, please? I too want to see Jesus. Of course I can. I too am an old man, but I will do my best and try. Thank you, my dear son. Come, and I will carry you on my shoulder. You are so light. It is strange, but I can carry you very easily. What is this? You now have become so heavy. Oh, it is you, my lord? Behold, this is my Saviour, Jesus Christ. Because you carried me, my beloved Bishoy, I will keep your body forever 
even after you die. Saint Bishoy died at the age of 97 after teaching many people to become monks and showing them the power of prayer. Oh, what a beautiful story, Dad. I too want to see Jesus, just as Saint Bishoy did. Oh, Lavinia, every day we see Jesus in church. We talk to him through our prayers, and when we help someone in need, we're actually helping our Lord Jesus. Right, Dad. Jesus said, Inasmuch as you did it to one of the least of these, my brethren, you did it to me. Yes, my dear. And now, it's time to go to sleep. Good night, Lavinia. Good night, Dad.